Murder Bag is a crime story about a serial killer who's bumping off the rich and powerful and um, the hero is the man who's going after him. DC Max Wolf of Homicide and Serious Crime Command. The starting point for the murder bag really was a conversation I had with uh, Sam Mendes just after Sam had signed up to direct uh, Skyfall. And we were talking about how much the James Bond books meant to us as kids. And he said he was going to go back to the books and go back to the essence of the books and the core of Ian Fleming. And um, it did make me think about um, how you would tell it, how you would create a hero for the 21st century. Because um, so many of the cultural heroes that are around now were around when I was a kid. I think that a culture uh, should also try to come up with some heroes that speak to our own age. And really that was my starting point with Max Wolf, trying to come up with a hero that would mean as much to people now as those old heroes did to me. And I do think that there's there's things about Max Wolf that, that haven't been done before. I mean, I think that I wouldn't have done it unless I felt I could bring something a little bit different, a little bit fresh to it. The murder bag will appeal to people that have read me in the past. I think that there's, uh, there's an em emotional clout to the character of Max Wolf. He's a single parent. He's defined largely um, by his work as a detective and his uh, role as a father. He's a hard man with a soft centre. He's a tough guy with a big heart. You know, he's a classic, gritty, resilient, courageous hero. He's someone I hope that people are going to like and going to want, going to want to spend time with. What I've tried to do in the murder bag, which I've never really done before, is bring together the two strands of my career, which is journalism and storytelling. First grown-up bit of journalism I ever wrote was when. I was embedded with uh, the Vice Squad at West End Central, 27 Savile Row. And really the research for the book began there. Um, Max works out of West End Central. And it's a book that I've been researching all my life, really. And when I started writing The Murder Bag, I wanted everything to be a little bit fresh, feel a little bit different. And I felt that um, there were elements that I could use in this story that hadn't been seen before in crime fiction. And one of them was a sense of place putting it in West End Central, putting it in Savile Row. London is really a character in the book because any good or great crime novelist has a really profound sense of location. And London is my town. So I've tried to capture the, uh, the mystery of the place and the glamour of the place and the danger of the place. If you're going to do crime fish, especially if you're going to enter it when you've, you've done other stuff, it's all got to be done well. I'm aware that these elements have to be completely convincing to crime fans. I know that they're very demanding. Crime fans uh, know their stuff. I wanted to give them a good original killer, an original murder weapon, and um, hopefully, a, you know, an engaging plot that they haven't seen before.